hello welcome back to my channel it is me it is i it is she it is the it is who it is me honey let me tell you let me tell you who i am it is rosie rosette 2020 pal how are you guys doing today i am doing i'm very frustrated because i'm waiting waiting on this fedex truck to drop off something they're supposed to drop it off at 12 o'clock right 12 o'clock it is 3 28 328 okay 328 i still don't have my package all right i still do not have my package anyway so i'm a little pissed off so you know face not facebook youtube y'all gonna get it, okay so anyway let me tell y'all something hey let me tell you something my time is valuable to me so if you want a part of my time basically i'm speaking to men all right men um time equals money okay let me tell you time equals money let me let you know okay so i've been celibate i haven't um really dated i think the only date that i've had in the past six years whatever was for my ex but i really don't call that a date because you know it was new even though he wanted me back or whatever but i was like nah you know he's he, he had got a divorce no i think he had separated from his wife but they were getting a divorce i don't do that i don't do that okay i don't do that i don't need anyone that bad that's connected to someone else no 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 no. If you want to deal with me you're gonna to have to divorce her first show me the papers show me them papers but i will say my ex did pay for my time okay i will say that he compensated me for my time very well very is very he was very good in that department Maybe that's why I'm spoiled. Now. I don't know. Anyway, he's not the only one. So, I've been happy, okay? I am very happy being single. I don't have to worry about no phone calls. I don't have to worry about fellatio or nothing like that. I don't have to, I don't have to worry about nothing. I go home. I come home, look at TV, shop, you know, put on makeup or whatever. I don't have to please anyone. I don't have to be validated anybody. I don't have to coo somebody's self-esteem or whatever. I don't have to do none of that. I come and go as I please. And I'm happy. Okay. I'm, I'm happy. Me. Okay. But there's, you know, there's some men who, I think it's a couple females too, who um, want to get to know me a little better want to take me out want to fly me out want to do this want to do that guess what that cost okay and i'm not saying it costs to be the boss but it costs time is money if you want to fly me out somewhere guess what i need to be prepared because i'm not coming nowhere to see no man half-assed well, okay, yeah, maybe half-ass, but I'm not, you know, I'm, I like to take pictures, okay? So if I like to take pictures, I need wigs, I need makeup, I need, you know, some outfits or whatever, because I'm fat, you know, I'm fat right now, so I don't have, I don't know, I don't know what clothes I can, because I haven't been anywhere, so I haven't really, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm overweight or whatever, so I got to get some clothes. Anyway, it costs to talk to me. And I'm not saying that I'm all that because I'm not. I'm old and I'm ugly. Let me see. Take off this wig and this makeup, baby. I look about 80 years old. Okay? Okay? So I'm not all that. But this is my time. All right? This is, you know, to, to, to be on the phone or text me or DM me or inbox me or whatever. That takes time. I'm 51 years old. I'm happy by myself. Okay? So, no, you ain't got to pay for my time right now because I'm not with you, all right? I'm not interested in no one. I don't care who you are. I don't care if you're a bum on the street. I don't care if you, you know, are a celebrity. I don't care if you're a billionaire. My time is precious. We're not even going to get into my body, okay? That's, ooh, that's a whole nother level or whatever, I'm not a hooker. I'm not a call girl or nothing. But my time is precious to me. So if my time is precious to me, which I value me and my time immensely, guess what? In order for you to waste my time to the point where I feel that you are valid enough to spend time with me, that is precious. 
I'm not talking about sex. I'm not talking about sex. So you know when people, guys are like, oh, well, what are you, what, what am I buying? You buy my time. My time. If you don't like it, if you don't want to pay for my time, guess what? Go to, there's a billion other women in this world. Okay, I won't say a billion. About a hundred million women in the world who would want to give you their time for free. I'm not one of them. I'm not one of them. So, May 1st, 2021, I'm going to create a cash app. If you want to talk to me or spend some time or whatever, you'd make a deposit in the cash app and then you can proceed to, to talk to me or whatever. I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't know. what. It, base, the bottom line is I don't want to waste my time. You know, all that, oh, how you doing? How you doing? Why are you worried about how I'm doing? Okay. Talk is cheap. If you want to spend time with me, if you want to get to know me better, then pay me for my time. Okay. Because I'm doing real good by myself. I, you rarely ever, if ever hear about me moping that I'm single. No, I may mope about not having money. I may mope about, you know, being overweight or not being able to travel like I want to, but you rarely hear me mope about being single, if at all. Now, I mean, you know, like when I was in Vegas two weeks ago or whatever, and then, you know, I saw the little couples and I kind of miss not having to pay for stuff. You know what I'm saying? Now, I miss that aspect of being in a couple, whatever, but all that drama and and just all of that, I'm not down for that. You know, people want you to talk to you every day. Why do you need to talk to me every day? I'm the same person I was the day before you talked to me. We don't need to talk to each other every day. And I remember I um, worked at some clinic or something. They took blood or whatever. And I remember this Asian guy. This was like, this was in Oakland on Peel Hill. Um, some Asian guy was like, I don't talk to my fiance every day. That ruins the, uh, he was Chinese, real cute Chinese, Chinese guy. And he was like, why? You know, we're, we're not married yet. You know, that's going to ruin the vacation. I mean, the relationship. And I was like, you know what? Yeah. I, I just didn't understand, but please believe me. One of the guys that said that was very, um, oh, the only date he took me out for my birthday okay i'm not gonna miss no birthday no birthday and he gave me gifts and did he give me money i don't think he gave me money anyway just a little cheap gifts or whatever but it was cute you know took me to a fancy restaurant you know spent a lot of money on the food i saw that bill and i was like you could have gave me this money honey we could have went to wendy's and you could have gave me this money instead of giving it to the restaurant but anyway that's a whole nother thing but um i'm just like i you know i think i i i think i may have anxiety about going you know being in a relationship because it's all blah 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 you know it's all that blah 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 and this is what they do this is this is the secret this is what they do so guys you know they're all perfect and wonderful you know for the first 3 months right and then they disappear either they disappear physically or they they flip and so you know around the 90 day you're like oh my god you know oh they're so wonderful you know you're like oh could he this be the one and blah 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 then they flip and then their real colors come out oh okay okay negro okay okay this is how it is all right okay well this is how it is okay well let me show you one better and so then i show them my my colors which they ain't real. It's just I tell them I put it on the I put it on the table. This is how I am. All right. This is how I am. And if you slip, this is how I will be. Then when you know when they 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 um they try and what they try and front. I'm like, oh, okay, I'm, I'm good. Yeah, blah 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 blah. Okay, okay. You know, listen. If you don't want me, you better let me go. Let me know and let me go, okay? Let me know and let me go because if I find out some stuff and we haven't discussed it or, you know, we don't have an understanding, poof, 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 poof. 
Now, I don't want to hear them crying. This guy's calling me from 20 years ago. 20 years ago. I had to block him on all social media. The last thing I'm going to do is block him on the phone. Now, if I do that, you know, I, I don't want him, you know, jumping off the bridge, committing suicide and all this other stuff or whatever. Oh, my goodness. I don't want all that. So, you know what? He, he just called me last week. 20 years old. This guy is 10 years younger than me. Dude, I don't, what, what, you know, if, listen, if I don't call people, okay, but if I do and you don't answer or respond in an appropriate manner or time, you ain't never got to worry about me talking. Believe that. And that's on everything I love, okay? Relatives, friends, people that I don't know. If I call you and you don't call me back in a timely manner, you ain't got to worry about ever talking to me again in life. That's just how I am. That's just how I am. So anyway, listen, the bottom line is my time is money. My time to me is valuable. I don't care if I sit in the bed all day for 20 hours straight. My time is valuable to me. Just like this FedEx was supposed to deliver something at 12, 12. It's 3.39, four hours later. Four hours later, I still don't have this package and I need this, it's coming from my job and I need to be here to sign for it. Four hours later, I've called FedEx. I made a case. They were supposed to get it to me immediately. Four hours later, I've been waiting. I've been waiting. Still nothing. Absolutely nothing. See, this shit right here, this is what I don't like. Mm -mm, don't mess with my time. Don't mess with my time and don't mess with my money. Don't mess with my time and don't mess with my money. All of that being said, I'm real serious. You know what I'm saying? I'm either on or off. I'm either all in or I'm not messing with you at all. You see what I'm saying? So when I say that my time is precious and you need to pay for my time, baby, yes. Because I can almost guarantee you when you get a little of this, not sexually, but mentally, okay? I'm educated. I'm beautiful. I'm worldly. I'm confident. I'm knowledgeable about a lot of things. You know, I'm not a guru of any sense, but I know a few things. I'm a little seasoned. Please believe, okay? When it comes to money, don't don't play around with me at all. At all. Okay? Now, I, it's not that I'm asking, it's just that that's my set price. That's a set price. You know what I'm saying? Just like you got to register for your car every every year, that it's a set price, baby. And if you got tickets, you got to pay a little more. And if you got some other fees, you got to pay a little more. Well, listen. It's a set price with me. All right? It's a set price, and please don't get it misconstrued that, you know, I think I'm all that. Yes, I do think my time is all that, and this is the only time I have. I am 51 years old. I'm not in my 20s. I'm not in my 30s. I'm not even in my 40s, although some people think that. No, I am 51 every minute of it, and I'm proud to be 51. Now, you young heifers, you need to take note. You need to take note. Don't. I had to let this girl know my job. Beautiful. Naturally. Not makeup. You know, five, to five tons of makeup with the wig. No, this girl was beautiful. Is beautiful. Naturally beautiful. She got two little kids. All these men are up in face. I said, honey, don't. And then I was like, Valentine's time. I said, did someone give you a gift? She said, no. I said, <laughs> no. That's not how it goes. Okay? Don't, don't waste your time on someone who really doesn't care about you, if a man cares about you, he will go out of his way to make sure you're good. And the minute that he stops, pay attention. The very second that he stops, the very second that he stops calling you, pay attention. The very second that he doesn't make sure you're good, pay attention because that means that somebody else is in the arena that he's paying attention to and you know what you don't have to leave him but just know just know and understand when he stops checking for you the way he was checking for you at the beginning pay attention pay attention it's not you know what the way things are are the way things needs to be okay and you take that however you want to.
You take that however you want to, Ooh, honey. This I tell you, FedEx is gonna get my blood pressure up. I, I these people are just oh god. And I wish these traders on on Facebook or YouTube or whatever the hell this is, Instagram. I wish they stopped following me. Oh my god, everybody wants to make some money. Everybody wants to make some money. Everybody wants to make some money. Whatever. Listen. So time is money. Time is money. Time is money. If you want my time, then I want your money. That's just time. Okay? That's just time. We're not even going to go any further. Okay? Ain't nothing for free. Nothing is for free. I'm not advocating anything. I'm just saying that people are value. And you need to know your worth. Okay? And if someone can't understand your worth, then hey! That's not my problem. I didn't venture out looking for you. You ventured out looking for me. Let's make this clear, okay? I don't go into anybody's inbox. I don't DM anyone, all right? Nothing. I don't call nobody. If I'm calling you, it's strictly about money or somebody's on their deathbed or something like that. I don't call anyone. You can ask the only person. There's two people I call. I call my bank and I call my son. Other than that and my doctors, okay? Other than, you know, but on a friendly thing, I don't call nobody. On business, I call FedEx. You see what I'm saying? But to call and chit chat, no, I got too much stuff to do. Now, if you want to call me, okay, fine. I'll talk to you. I will talk your ear off. But you can guarantee I'm not calling you. I don't really care about how you are. If you want to tell, let me know how you are. Because I don't want to call and hear about people's problems. I got too many problems of my own. And then people will be having some stupid ass problems. And you know, my mouth, the way I react, I don't have a filter. So to prevent all that, listen, I got, you know, I got, a, I got enough phones to talk to enough people. Listen, no, 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 no. But if I do call you, if I do call you, then I'm sincere. I have time, you know, I have time allowed, 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 allotted to talk. But I don't call everybody every day and see how they're doing and checking up. Because ah, I don't want to know. I honestly don't want to know. Okay, let that be known. I don't want to know about how you're doing every day. I, I I don't really care how you're doing every day unless unless you're sick or whatever. But I'm not your doctor. I can't do anything for you every day. And then you know people when they sick they get evil. I'm like, oh honey, no 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 no. I'm not trying to curse nobody out. I'm not trying to curse anybody else. So I just stay in my own lane. Okay. So I don't call bothering people. Mm -mm. No. I don't want to call. You know my, you know, and, and and I can talk, and you call that a decent hour. Oh my God, I can talk for hours, hours on end. And believe me, you know, for you hating bitches or whatever, say no, oh, she's only interested into makeup and beauty. Okay, you think you let well, listen, let that let that be your knowledge of me. Okay, let that be your knowledge of me. I don't really care how you think about me. That's your problem. Those are your issues. Those are your insecurities, not mine. I'm doing cool over here. I'm good. All right. As soon as this FedEx thing comes, I'm good. Okay. Now, any questions, any comments, let me know. All right. Let me know and let me go. <laughs> Bye, you guys. I will talk to you later. Oh, I'm about to go downstairs and wait for this FedEx because they are, are I, I got things to do today. Bye.